April 2021, Nestle divested its water business in North America, and that business became Blue Triton Brands. We manufacture and deliver an unrivaled portfolio of water brands for healthy hydration. We have springs and manufacturing sites all over the US and Canada, and we also have our own delivery service, Ready Refresh. As we transitioned from our old ownership group, Cognizant was a tremendous partner in helping us redefine how do we staff, how do we support the different types of initiatives that our new structure demanded. We certainly have thrown a lot of curveballs at Cognizant since we've started our relationship with them. In any large-scale business like ours, things change. And in the Ready Refresh in particular, we're a direct-to-consumer business, so we're susceptible to consumer demand. Cognizant's been a great partner, so as consumers demand a different experience on the website or in the app, they've been able to help us adapt and quickly adjust to those needs. We're also a proud partner to their direct-to-consumer Ready Refresh transformation across IT and contact center operations by improving their customer and agent experience. Staffing in something like our call center, as calls go up or emails go up, they've been able to flex their staffing and allow us to continue to provide a great experience for our customers. On the development side, the ability to flex up and down with different technology sets as we want to put more effort or energy into one to improve the customer experience. Cognizant is right there on the front lines with us, helping us adapt and adjust our systems and our technology, and frankly, our service models to make sure we're supporting those growth areas. I feel a sense of pride whenever I see a ready refresh truck in my neighborhood to know that we in Cognizant have been helping Blue Triton achieve their mission of sustainably providing fresh water to communities across North America. What I've been very impressed with with Cognizant, whether it's good news or bad news, the leadership is open to the feedback. And what we've been able to do is if it's a surprise on the good side, we lean into that and how do we take advantage of that and how do we leverage that? If it's a surprise on the bad side, we very quickly are focused on how do we go fix that? How do we address the problem? In general, I would say they're very adaptable. In the end, they just want a partner to be successful.